हाउ कैन यू सेंड ऑटोमेटिक रिन्यूअल रिमाइंडर्स टू योर क्लाइंट्स कैसे आप अपने क्लाइंट्स को रिन्यूअल्स के लिए रिमाइंडर्स भेज सकते हो वी विल लर्न इन दिस वीडियो Hi there I'm Kevil Kishan India's leading business automation coach and past 8 years I have been helping service providers like financial planners insurance advisors on helping them growing their business by automating their processes on Google Form sheets and with WhatsApp automation Now let's check out on how can you send automated renewal reminders to your clients Now for the same what I have done I have created a quick PPT and we shall go through the pointers in the same make sure you have a notebook and a pen and you start making notes as well Now first of all let's understand on why you need automatic reminder systems if you are a financial planner or if you are a insurance advisor right when you do a policy of your client you know whenever there is a renewal date right you keep reminding your clients that okay the 10 days left for the policy expiry or 10 days left for this plan but we do we keep reminding them manually and what happens because of our manual follow with the client clients always renew right the policy is on almost the last day and we at the last day when they say okay please send us the detail we keep arranging information and documents to share with them and those days become really clutter and when it comes to the you know insurance policies or financial planning you know subscriptions each every client has a different different deadline so it means every day there is a there is a you know environment of deadlines in your business where every other day there is some deadline which is getting expired of one or two clients all right and what happens if we forget so if you forget to remind the client the client also forgets to renew the policy and at the end client get back to you and keeps shouting at you that how could you forget about it right and even sometime client get irritated with your back to back calls you want to remind them or your team wants to remind them but if your team calls too much to client clients get irritated right and these are things which i have experienced in my life as well when i had you know done couple of insurances and taken you know, few financial plans i used to receive a lot of calls from those experts from whom i took the service and i always used to wonder on why they are calling back to back right and i used to cut most of the calls but better would be if i could have got some automated emails or some automated whatsapp so what happens as a financial planner or as an insurance advisor you are wasting your time your energy on performing these clerical activities which actually could be automated I understand your pain which you are facing in your business right now. I quickly comment below how many hours you waste every week in manual follow-ups from your clients. Few hours, five hours, ten hours, fifteen hours. How many hours you waste? And if you are not a financial planner or insurance advisor, you might be some other type of business owners. Like you might be a manufacturer or a trader. Then what do you do? You keep reminding the clients about the pending payment. and again you do the manual follow ups yes or no so quickly tell me in the comment box how much time do you waste on manual follow up from your clients now here i'll just give you a quick you know demo of the automatic reminder tool which could solve this problem forever now before i show you that let me show you the features and talk about that the you know automatic reminder tool that i'll be showing you this is a system through which automatically you can send emails and whatsapp reminders to all your clients and it will be going customized according to the due date of the client's renewal policies and you can even design what email you want to send what messages you want to send and once the setup is ready it will start performing on its own right and automatic automatically you can send even the images and even the pdf files on whatsapp or on email so when you say pdf files it means that if you want to send for example policy details or if you want to send a financial plan right you want to send some pdf documents that also could be automatically going from google sheet right 
you can send multiple reminders as per your schedule. For example, if today is a deadline, so you can send one message two days before, one message four days before, one message seven days before. And you can even customize the schedule as per your requirement. So are you excited to check on how the automation reminder tool work? So let's check it out on how the system work. So this is a really, really simple system, which is right now helping insurance advisors and financial planners to get the most out of their business. Let me show you on how this work. So this is where the, this is one of the sheet, which is called data. Okay. Where you add all your clients name and along with the email address, along with the contact number, right? And here you can define the due date. For example, if I talk about myself and if I'm the client of someone, somebody's, you know, giving me a insurance policy and I am his customer and then that person should have my database like this, including my name, including my email, including my contact number. And this is where he or she can define what is the due date of the policy. So example, if I choose this due date that, okay, this is the last date of the policy. And if uh, cable does not renew it, the policy will be expired. And this is where the PDF or any document can also be attached to, you know, attached here. And how to do that? You can upload your PDF documents on Google drive and you can add a link here. Here you can add the, you know, the amount and here even you can add other details like policy number just I'm just adding the random data here here you can even add the payment link which you want to send to the client it could be a insta mozo link razor pay link or something else right or even here you can add your your or company account detail and that will go to the client so the same way you added all the clients right, which are your recurring clients, which have taken the policy from you or which have taken any financial plan from you, right? You add the data set, add the details, attachments, amount and percentage. Once you have added all the clients data, then second will be that you need to define the messages which you want to send to them. So this is where you define your messages. And here minus 14 means that this message will go 14 days before the due date and here every client will have a different different due date so this system will pick up the due date and 14 days before that due date of that particular client this message will go from your whatsapp and from your email automatically now here you can see if i zoom it a little bit here it says dear and then the name is coming in you know the uh, brackets. So this name is getting picked from this particular column, this column, right? So a different message will go to different people like dear Cable, dear Rajesh, dear Amit. And the same way here it says, please renew your policy. And here the policy number is coming in the brackets. And again, this is the column coming from this, right? So here, whatever policy number will be automatically, it will be picked up here in this message. And the policy expiry date is due date. Again, this is coming from that particular table. And here it says only 14 days are left. You can call us at this number or you can directly renew the payment, renew the policy using this link. And here the payment link is also coming, right? So this message we have defined that, okay, minus 14 means 14 days before it will go. And what will be the time? It will go at 11 a.m. 11 means at 11 a.m. Automatically from your system, from your WhatsApp, it will go. Then seven days before we have added seven here. And if I make it minus nine, then this message will go nine days before. But right now, just to you know explain you, I've written seven here. So here again, the same message you can copy below. And instead of 14 days, you can define seven days here, right? Here, two days before, you can write two days here, only two days are left. Here, this message will go one day before. Right. And here you have written that tomorrow is the last date. Please renew or it will be expired. And here zero means that this message will go on the due date. That okay, today is the last day. Please renew. Right. And there is a way using which if somebody has paid, your teammate can update here 
and the message will stop going to that person. So example, if somebody has paid the insurance on seven days before or two days before, then for that client, the message will not go, right? The further messages. And this is where in this system, you can define whether you want to send them emails or not, whether you want to send them automated WhatsApp or not. And this is where you define your WhatsApp API key. Now here, you might be wondering, Kibble, what is WhatsApp API key, right? So you might be using WhatsApp for your day-to-day -day, you know, activities to talk to your family, talk to your friends, talk to your employees. But what if automated WhatsApp could go to your clients through this Google Sheet? For that, you need a WhatsApp API. And what I mean by WhatsApp API is, this is something which we provide to our students in India. Using this system, you scan your you know, contact number and you get a unique WhatsApp API, which you add to this Google Sheet system Okay, and from your mobile, these messages will start going to your clients, which you have defined here, including policy number and other details as well, automatically, right? So this is how this entire system work. And whatever emails and WhatsApp will be going from your side, here in the email log sheet, all the log will be coming up, which clients have received which message. And here, the WhatsApp log will define which WhatsApp messages have been sent to which clients, right? And you'll get to know what's happening. So automated notifications and reminders to your clients so that instead of you running after them, instead of you wasting your time, right? On reminding them manually, on, you know, making clients getting irritated with back-to-back -back calls on wasting your time and energy. Now, this system will remind them so that more than 80% of your clients renew the policies or the financial plans without you giving them even a single call. And, you know, the perfection is a myth. Not all clients will, you know, renew just only with the WhatsApp or with the, you know, calls. Few clients will require few calls. But using these systems, your efforts will be reduced more than 80%. And not only yours, your employees' efforts also. So what is the benefit of you know, using these kind of automated reminder system for your insurance and financial planning business? So you and your teammates, you save tons of hours of yours and your staff. And you know what happens when we get 10 clients, 15 clients, 30 clients, and we are not able to remind them for the renewals. So at the end, our mind says, okay, you, know, you cannot handle more clients. And you don't seek out new clients, you just keep serving existing clients. And even if you want to get new clients, you don't have time. Because your existing clients are taking so much of time on doing things and you will have to manually get involved. But using these systems, you can handle 10 times more clients with same number of resources. And at the result, when more clients you acquire and they are paying the policies and plans on time, you are first of all helping them because now there are less chances that the policy will be lapsed, right? And along with that, they are not getting back-to-back -back calls from you. It is saving their time as well. And you're getting more profits, more commission with the faster renewals. And, you know, clients also feel that you are a professional person. You are a professional business owner who is actually sending them automated messages. And it increases your reputation in their eyes. And they give you more referrals from their families and friends. And at the end, the business will have less leakage as compared to the leakage which is happening right now. The less chance of policy lapses and happy and tension-free life of yours and your employees and of your customers as well. I hope you like today's video and you can see a bell icon given below and subscribe button as well. The least which I expect from you is to subscribe the channel right now because every week we are coming with you know tons of value-driven videos for you to upgrade your business. Share this video with your fellow insurance providers and financial planners as well right and comment below on how many hours you waste in manual payment follow-ups or renewal reminder follow-ups from your clients because these systems can change it and can help you grow your business and in fact this week i'm conducting one live workshop as well for you to understand on how can you automate your business using google form sheets and whatsapp automation so in the description you can check out the link will be given and join my business automation webinar Although it's paid, but right now we are running it free. Join and understand on in today's time, how can you automate and grow your business? Because without systems, running a business is like running a car without engine. 
So I hope you love the video on how can you send automated renewal reminders to your clients and share with your uh, insurance friends and financial plan friends as well. I'll see you in next week in another YouTube videos to help you upgrade your business. Thank you so much.